Hello and welcome to the, to the Dave Verdan Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Greg Royce, joined by Stevenson Head Track and Field Coach Dave Verdan. And Coach, uh, we're, it doesn't feel like it, but it's spring out there. But uh, first we'll wrap up the winter and um, the NCAA Indoor Nationals where you had three student-athletes compete. You had uh, Derek Davis, Kimberly Hammond, and Richie Case. So kind of talk about how all three of them did up in Boston. Yeah, so I mean, it was a really good experience for all three of them. Yeah. The nice thing is that all three of them are underclassmen with yeah. Derek only being a sophomore and Richie a sophomore, and then Kim yeah. only a junior. Um, Derek just missed making the final yep. in the 60. He, it's kind of like, I mean, just a couple tenths of a second out. Yeah. But again, great experience. And then Richie and Kim, again, great experiences. They didn't do as well as they would have liked to, yeah. but um, it's okay. I mean, it's, it's such a different event, and for yeah. them to get to experience it, knowing that they get to go back next yeah. year, potentially. Yeah, I think that's a big thing, is really your first time, you know, We've had this conversation before where you really your first time is kind of get your bearings, kind of get your feet wet. It's hard to go in there the first time and really maybe do quite as well as you'd like, but once you get that experience, it certainly helps you going forward. Yeah, absolutely. It's it's really nice to, like I said, to have that experience as an underclassman because now they know what to expect next right. year. It's just it's such a different different event compared to everything they went to throughout yeah. the season. Yeah, absolutely. All right, and this past weekend you opened up the outdoor season with a meetup at Widener and. Um, some school records, some personal bests, and um, you know some some top times in the region of the country. So kind of yeah. talk a little bit, you know, how that went for you. Yeah, so I mean, across the board, it was a great weekend. Yeah. I mean, it was tough to even like really single people out, right? Because it was such a great event just across the board and yeah. every event. I mean, every event group. Uh, we did have a few school records: Pat Watson and Emily Gates in the 10K, yeah. and then um, Forrest Allen in the the hammer throw yeah. and then I think we had something like 15 personal bests yeah so it was, it was a really good weekend yeah and it's certainly encouraging that you have student athletes getting their personal best this early because obviously yeah. you know like we talked about there's a month until the conference meet which is also a wider so that's also another advantage is that you were at a meet you know where you're gonna be competing you know in about a month for the conference title so yeah definitely so really like, like you said I mean first meet of the year for us outdoors to have that many great results was it's definitely encouraging yeah absolutely um you know, you've got, like you said, you've got a few meets coming up. You are you know, heading to Rowan, I believe, this weekend. Mm -hmm. And then, um, you, you know, you're at Hopkins. So, obviously, you've know, got some meets coming up to prepare. But, you know, really, like you said, it's about a month until that conference meet. So, it's really a short, compact season. So, you know, how do you handle that with training and everything else? I mean, it's challenging. But, I mean, the coaching staff's really creative with, yeah. with figuring out where, just their workouts and where they're practicing and things like that. But, yeah. um, I mean, we're confident just with the way things went this weekend that, I mean, give another month that yeah. I mean, will be even better. And then hopefully after that, we have a bunch of people going to the national championships at the end of May as well. Yeah, absolutely. All right, Coach, well, I um, wish you and your athletes the best of luck, and uh, we'll chat probably right before the conference championship. Thanks, Greg. All right, for Dave Dan, I'm Greg Royce. This has been the Dave Dan Show.